Hello guys, welcome back to Kidroy Tips and in this video we're going to talk about how to fix. You can't make calls after iOS 17 update. So when we are trying to make some calls to any number, you are not able to make it because of uh, many reasons after iOS 17 update. This particular issue is happening for both iOS 17.1.1 update as well and even for many users after updating to iOS 17.1.2. So, uh, if you're having the trouble, you can just follow these instructions which is going to work for you guys. And the first one is all about, we have to turn on airplane mode. So, to turn on airplane mode, we have to go over here. There is an option called airplane mode. Just tap on airplane mode over here. Now, as you can see, you have to turn on the airplane mode. And once after you're done with the airplane mode, you have to wait. And once you're done with this one, you just need to turn this off. And afterwards, you have to make sure that it is working fine. So this is the first step. So you have to turn on the airplane mode and you have to turn it off after a quiet second. And once afterwards, you have to check whether you are able to make the calls or not. If, if you are having still the trouble, we can move to the next step. Next step is all about, you have to restart your iPhone. So to do a restart on your iPhone, we have to tap over here in the press icon, that is volume up, followed by volume. You have to press and hold the power button unless and until you see the Apple logo. So let me do this. You have to press the volume up followed by volume down and you have to press and hold the power button unless and until you see Apple logo. It will be like a new start for your iPhone. So let me do this. So just press volume up followed by volume down and you have to press and hold the power button unless and until you see the Apple logo like this. Now the font is being turned off. Now we just need to wait because you have to see the Apple logo. Once you see the Apple logo, you have to wait because the phone has to get completely booted up. It is like a giving a restart. So once after done with the forced restart, you have to try and you have to check whether the issue is solved or not. So now what we need to do is we just need to go over here. Let me unlock the phone. And now we just need to check whether you are able to make any calls or not. Still, if you are having the trouble, we can move to the next one. That is all about, we have to remove the SIM card. So you have to remove the SIM card from your uh, iPhone and you have to reinsert it back because sometimes any kind of issue might be with the SIM card or it might be misplaced, which is causing the issue up. So just remove the SIM card, put it back, then try and you have to make sure that is working fine. Still, if you are having the trouble, we can move to the fourth step. That is, you have to make sure that DND is turned off. That is, do not disturb is turned off. So just go over here. If the do not disturb mode is completely turned on, you have to make sure that it is not turned on. If the do not disturb mode is on, you have to turn this off because you have to cross check whether the DND is there or not. So if DND is turned on, you have to make turn it off. That is what you have to do. Fifth step is all about, we have to make sure the time zone and time and date is correct. Just tap over here in the settings. Keep scrolling down and navigate to general. Now from here we have to go to date and time. Now from here you have to make sure the time and time zone is correct. And also you have to make sure the time zone is correct as well. For example, you might be migrating from one place to another or from one country to another. And if the time zone is not being set into correct one, you will be having the trouble. So just cross check it is all done in that way. Last and the least one is all about we have to do a reset network settings. So just tap over here in the settings. Keep scrolling down and navigate to general. Now from here, scroll down and navigate to transfer a reset iPhone. Tap on reset. Go for a reset network settings, which is very important. You have to go for reset network settings. Once you're done with the reset network setting, most probably the issue will be completely fixed. And this is what we have to do. And I hope this is helpful. And if you find this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification. See you soon in the next video. Peace out. Bye bye.